Another great product of the Comfort Company is its amputee support. And the amputee support is an ancillary seating product that we have designed for patients with that go through an amputation. Um, to support the residual limb that's left over, we, there's a couple things that we needed to address. It needed to be adjustable so that the height of the cushion is going to match the, the height of the amputee pad. It's going to be able to get out of the way very easily. We've incorporated a swing away mechanism into it so that for transfers, for the patient to get into the chair, it's going to be relatively easy and they are going to be able just to swing it back. As well as swinging the amputee bracket away, we have incorporated a removable feature. And there's been a couple different revisions on this hardware in order to make it work phenomenally and also to increase the rigidity of it and the strength of it. So the features of the hardware to swim away and to be removable and the adjustments up and down and in and out are all things that we'll talk about with the hardware. But first let's start with the pad. The pad itself was designed so that it's very soft and plush. So this feature is very important, especially for new amputees. For a residual limb, when it's sitting on a, a, a pad, it's got to be soft because there's going to be sores, there's going to be drainage, there's going to be... Um, so we needed to, to a, account for the drainage and for the sores and the fact that this is a very easily cleanable surface. We use our Comfort Tech material. It's got the venom material on the side so that if it would run into anything this is our most durable fabric that we have to offer so we made it comfortable we made it easy to clean it's actually removable there's a zipper on the back side of it so you can actually take this off you can take the pad off we've got an inch and a half of foam on here so it's very soft we've added a contour to it so for positioning of the residual limb it's it's going to hold the limb in place the hardware, a couple things about the hardware that we've done. We have designed a quick release adjustment. So with this hardware, when it's on, we can match it to the pad and with one release, we can actually adjust this up and down. So let me put this on here, adjust the limb. And if you actually hear that clicking, those are gear teeth. Those gear teeth will actually mate and match so that when you pick your angle and you tighten down your limb, your, your lever, that's going to stay in its spot. It's not going to move. You can sit on this. You can bounce on it. You can use this as a transfer board. It's as sturdy as we possibly could make it. So how do we account for the different heights of cushions? There is a clamp underneath here that with one bolt that with one bolt we can loosen it up and we can account for different cushion heights. So we can adjust the angle, we can adjust the height. We actually can even adjust the in and out. So let me just tighten this down. I'm going to pop this off so you can see this with two bolts right here. We can actually adjust this pad in and out. This will allow us to accommodate for different seat depth for chairs that the uh, Facilities are going to stock in a 16. If they need to go to an 18 deep, uh, they'll put a little two inch extension piece onto the end. This now you can mount and actually accommodate for that extra seat depth that they're going to be gaining by the little extension depth. So being able to move this in and out and account for different cushion depths and seat depths is a very important to be able to get that right where you need to. The pad itself, you can get in various different depths. So ideally you're going to order this in a half inch or half of the width of your cushion width or your seat width. So on the 18 wide you're going to get a 9 wide amputee support 
and these are going to match up perfectly with the contour of the cushion. I mentioned before the durability. The couple things that we've done with the redesign of this hardware, and this was just redesigned last year. The swing away mechanism itself, which is also the removable mechanism, we have put a Teflon coated oil impregnated steel insert pressed into this bracket. What this does is actually a self lubricating metal that over time as its stress gets put on it, it actually lubricates itself and forces that oil out. The steel that we use is going to keep it from coming out of the round so that over time with use after use after use, it's going to fit over the, the receiver every single time and it's not going to have any slop in it. The swing away mechanism is now a, a PVC dipped lever so it's very easy to use and you can use this over and over again without having to worry about anything wearing out. This is the most durable, easy to use amputee support on the market right now. The receiver on the chair will actually mount onto a three quarter inch tubing size and it'll fit everything in between an inch and an eighth. So from three quarter inches to an inch and an eighth and everything in between, so your seven eighths tubing, your one inch tubing, and the new design on that is to fit onto the inch and the eighth because a lot of our rigid frames have gone, our lightweight rigid frames have gone to an inch and an eighth tubing size. So our lightweight users that have, our lightweight wheelchair users that need the amputee support on it, it'll fit on those leg hangers now. So the pad we've gone over, soft, plush pad. The hardware being adjustable up, down, in, out, swing away, removable, the durability that we've added to it. One of the redesigns of this, we've actually added durability and we have actually reduced the weight of it. So the weight was reduced by over half of the amount. So over the last couple of years, we have increased durability, we've reduced weight, and we've actually added adjustment to this bracket. And those are the features of the amputee bracket which make this thing the best thing on the market right now.